Hey guys, I've been doing as many uh, videos because I actually filled up my whole hard drive with uh, files, so there's no more place left. But thankfully, I got my uh, new, brand new, iOmega HDD hard drive, which is a uh, one terabyte of space, which is 1,000 gigs. So um, I'm gonna make got a lot of room now. That's definitely for sure. And um, so we're gonna start out with this video. It's how to change your boot screen. Like when you first start up a computer, it shows like Windows XP and it has like the little loading bars like da -da 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 -da, like that. Um, we're gonna show you how to change that. So first, you're gonna go to the first link on the right of the description. It'll be Start Off Boot Skin, and you're gonna go right here, download the blue button, and download it for Vista or XP, whichever one you have. I have XP, so I'm gonna hit download. I'm going to hit download now. And then you're going to start. Hit click here to start. And then save it. Save it to your desktop. I already have it, so I won't save it. Go through the installation wizard. It's really easy. And then it'll be right here. I have a start up. But um, you'll have some that are really, really dumb. Like you'll have this one. You'll have this one. Pretty much they all suck. And if you try and browse them here, you can't, because when customize is now <gasps> broken. That's right, broken. So we're going to show you how to get more. So the second link in the video description will be this deviant art. And uh, right here, we're going to type in Windows space boot skin in deviant art and hit enter. After that, you're going to just scroll down. You can go to the next page and stuff. Find on you like. I personally like this uh, New York City boot skin. And it'll look like this. That'll be loading too. I love that. So I'm going to go to the computer monitor here. I'm going to hit download. I am going to save. Save it to my desktop. And then open it. It'll open in in a WinRAR file, so make sure you have that up and just hit NYC Bootskin. Double click that, open up into Bootskin. You see it's right there. Preview it and see it's really easy, easy. Then you just hit Apply. Bootskin applied successfully. Now um I can't show you it because of course when I restart my computer will be off and I lost my camera right now. So maybe next time I'll show you uh, the Bootskin, but it's really simple and remember you can go back through here and uh... you can like just scroll down through like hundreds and hundreds of boot screens um... like literally hundreds and you can just pick anyone you really want like windows seven and stuff windows homer windows pegasus pretty much anything and um... Yeah, so uh, please guys, don't forget to subscribe. It helps so much, and it just shows me that people are actually watching my videos, so that I can make even more. So um, thanks. Uh, just don't forget to subscribe, and um.